Hello everyone! In this video, we'll discuss top 5 best free screen recording software. Thank you for joining the video. And let's get started. This video is a part of the Udemy course Manual Software Testing Interview Q&A for QA. For more information, check the description or visit the website testany101.net below the video. In our course, we will already talk about web, mobile, networking, API, and performance tool that can help QA engineers in the work. All of them are very complex and take a lot of time for beginners to learn. Today, we want to talk about a less complex but no less and perhaps more important tool used by all testers, and that is screen capture on tools. It is a software designed to capture or record what is currently being displayed on your computer or mobile device screen. These tools are widely used in various industries, including education, software development, design, and technical support. At first glance, taking a screenshot may seem like a straightforward topic that is understandable for everyone. There are many tools on the market that make screenshots. Even more, each operating system has its own built-in tool, and why look for a separate one? The point is that now screen capturing tool has much more functionality than it seems at first glance. Some essential of them include saving files in different formats and sizes, capturing not only photos but also videos, edit image, add text, etc. The additional include sharing in online resources, photo or highlight cursor, ability to set up the hotkeys, and capture not the full screen but only the section. If with additional functions everything is more or less clear, let's talk about why essential functions are so important. For example, saving files in different formats and sizes. Some tools might capture the 5-minute video on the AIMKV format that will take 200 MB and will not open in Jira, while another tools might capture the same 5 minutes of video on MP4 format that will take 5 MB and will open in Jira. Another example is about the editing the photo screenshots. QA engineers very often need to write a text on show on arrow, etc. to show where the expected result and where the actual result on the screenshot. Therefore, edit functions play a crucial role during screen capturing. We think it's now clear that screen capturing is not as simple as it seems. So in this video, we'll consider top 5 best free screen recording software, in particular, ShareX, GreenShot, LightShot, ScreenRack, and Snipping Tool. Each of these tools has its own advantages and disadvantages as well as features that the one tool supports while other tools doesn't. Usually, the project does not allocate additional funds for this type of tools, so we'll showcase only free screen recording software. The first screen recording tool that you can use for free is ShareX. ShareX is an open source tool with a wide range of features. It supports various capture methods, including full screen, window, and region capture. It also includes built-in editing tools and supports many output formats. To download and install ShareX on your device, visit getsharex.com. On the website, locate the download option and after downloading, follow the on-screen instructions to complete the installation. Once the installation is complete, you can launch the tool. On the main navigation screen, you will find hotkeys and explanations for each, making it easy to capture screenshots or videos. To capture the entire screen, use the default hotkey, usually print screen, or set a custom hotkey in the settings. For example, press Ctrl from print screen on the screen you want to capture, let's say home screen on the ShareX tool, then click on the screen, and it will be captured. The screenshot of the entire screen will be displayed at the bottom right corner of the screen. To open the screenshot, click on it. Captured screen will be opened via one of the tools which was set as default one on your using device. Also, you can find the screenshot on the main screen of the ShareX tool. To capture a specific area, window or other options, you can choose the capture method from the toolbar or use the hotkeys associated with those methods. After triggering the tool, ShareX automatically opens the image editor and you also have the option to open it manually after the screen will be captured. 
Within the image editor, you can make edits, add annotations, highlight areas, or apply various modifications. Let's try to add edits to the screenshot, in particular text annotation. Press Ctrl plus print screen on the screen you want to capture. Let's say the load page of the ShareX website. The screenshot editor window will be displayed. Select the text outline option on the image editor toolbar and add desired text to the screenshot, afterward clicking on the OK button of the input text window. The text message will appear on your screenshot. It's a very useful feature for emphasizing issues during testing and helping developers better understand and fix bugs quickly. In this video, we'll look at just a few features of ShareX tool. In fact, this tool supports quite a lot of useful functionality, which you can familiarize yourself with on the screen. ShareX has its pros and cons. The advantages include 1. Open source. Being open source means that the source code is freely available to the public. This fosters transparency, allows users to modify the software, and often results in a vibrant community. Another advantage is 2. Customizable workflows. ShareX allows users to customize and automate their workflows, defining specific actions after a capture, such as saving to a specific folder, copying to the clipboard, or uploading to a cloud service. Another advantage is 3. Supports numerous output formats. ShareX supports a wide range of output formats for both images and videos, providing users with flexibility in saving and sharing captures. And one more advantage is 4. Supports various capture methods. ShareX supports capturing the entire screen, specific regions, active windows, or even scrolling captures, providing flexibility for different use cases. In addition to the advantages, ShareX also has its disadvantages, such as 1. Complex interface. The interface can be overwhelming for new users, with an abundance of features and settings that may be intimidating for those looking for a more straightforward tool. Another disadvantage is 2. The ShareX is not ideal for casual users. The advanced features and customization options may be more than what a casual user needs. Now, let's move on to the next screen recording software, that is GreenShot. GreenShot is a lightweight and open-source screenshot tool that allows users to capture a selected area, window, or the entire screen. GreenShot also includes basic annotation and editing features. To download and install GreenShot on your device, visit getgreenshot.org. On the website, find the Download Now option, and after downloading, follow the on-screen instructions to install the tool. Making a screenshot using GreenShot is a straightforward process. Let's try to do that. Find the GreenShot tool on your device and run it. Once GreenShot is running, click on the GreenShot icon in the system tray. The GreenShot toolbar will be displayed. You can use one of the following methods to capture a screenshot. Capture region, capture last region, capture window, capture full screen. For example, to capture a region, let's say home screen of the GreenShot website, choose capture region option of the GreenShot toolbar and select the area you want to capture. After selecting the area, a drop-down menu with saving options will be displayed on the bottom right corner of the screen. Select the desired option like Save As and Save the Screenshot. We have only covered a few features of the GreenShot. You can familiarize yourself with more GreenShot features on the screen. Although comparing with ShareX tool there are a little less of them, in particular GreenShot doesn't support video capturing, it's still very useful and has unique features like obfuscation, blur, etc. GreenShot, like other tools, has its pros and cons. The advantages include 1. It's easy to use. GreenShot is known for its simplicity and user-friendly interface, making it suitable for users with varying levels of technical expertise. Another advantage is 2. Free and open source. GreenShot is open source software, freely available, with its source code accessible and modifiable by the community. 3. Another advantage is 
export options. GreenShot supports the export of captured images in various formats, including popular ones like PNG, JPEG, and GIF. However, GreenShot also has its disadvantages, such as limited advanced features. GreenShot may lack some advanced features available in other screenshot tools. If you require highly advanced editing or capturing functionalities, GreenShot might not be most feature-rich option. Another disadvantage is no video capture. GreenShot is primarily designed for capturing screenshots and does not have built-in capabilities for recording videos of your screen. Let's move on to the next screen recording software that you can use for freely namely, LightShot. LightShot is a simple and easy-to-use screen capture tool allowing users to capture a selected area and includes basic editing features. LightShot also offers an online platform for sharing screenshots. To download and install the application on your device, navigate to the following link. On the website, you should find the download option and after downloading, follow the on-screen instructions to install the tool on your device. Creating a screenshot using LightShot is a simple process. Once the installation is complete, launch LightShot on your computer, usually found in your system tray near the clock, or by searching for LightShot in your applications. After clicking the app icon, your screen will dim and you can click and drag to select the area you want to capture, for example, part of the home page of the LightShot website. Once you selected the desired area, the LightShot opens a simple editor where you can add annotations, highlights, errors, text and more. You can also crop or resize the screenshot as needed. For example, click on the marker icon on the editor window and highlight the desired element on the screenshot. The elements will be highlighted with the selected color. After annotating, if desired, you can save the screenshot to your computer. LightShot also provides options to share the screenshot online and obtain a shareable link. For example, to create a shareable link, click on the following link. After uploading, the link with the screenshot will be displayed on the bottom right corner of the screen. You can open it or copy it by clicking on the corresponding button near the link. We have only covered a few features of the LightShot. You can familiarize yourself with more LightShot features on the screen. Although comparing with ShareX tool there is no video capture as well, it also has unique features like search similar images, etc. LightShot, like other tools, also has its pros and cons. The advantages of this tool are It's free and open source. LightShot is open source software, making it freely available to users, and the source code is accessible for transparency and community collaboration. Another advantage is the ease of use. LightShot is known for its user-friendly interface, making it accessible for users with varying levels of technical expertise. In addition to the advantages, this tool also has the disadvantages, such as Limited advanced features. LightShot may lack some advanced features available in other screenshot tools. If you require highly advanced editing or capturing functionalities, LightShot might not be the most feature-rich option. Another disadvantage is no video capture. LightShot is primarily designed for capturing screenshots and does not have built-in capabilities for recording videos on the screen. Another one is interface customization. The level of interface customization may be limited compared to other screenshot tools. Users looking for extensive customization options might find it lacking in these regards. One more interesting tool for capturing your screen for free is ScreenRack. ScreenRack is a screen recording and screenshot capturing software that allows users to capture their computer screens. To download and install the application on your device, navigate to the screenrack.com. On the website, you should find the download free option and after downloading, follow the on-screen instructions to install the tool on your device. Once the installation is complete, you can launch and use the tool. Let's try to do that. Open the Screen Rack application on your computer and start a new recording session. On the screen, the tool will display a toolbar with the options such as Take a Screenshot, Start Recording, View All Screen Captures and Settings. For example, to record a video, click on the Start Recording button of the ScreenRack toolbar menu and select the desired area that you would like to record, 
let's say home page of the ScreenRec website. After a 3 second countdown, screen recording will begin. To stop recording and save the video, press the record button on the ScreenRec menu or use the Alt plus S shortcut on the keyboard. Once the video is recorded, you can save it by clicking on Save to your computer button that is displayed at the bottom of the video player window. We have only covered a few features of the screen rack. You can familiarize yourself with more screen rack features on the screen. Screen rack offers more features for recording videos, including the instant sharing video function, etc. Screen rack also has its pros and cons. The advantages of this tool are its free plan available. ScreenRack offers a free plan with basic features, making it accessible for users with different needs. Another advantage is its cloud storage. The tool has the ability to store recordings and screenshots in the cloud, allowing for easy sharing and access from different devices. Another advantage is quick sharing. ScreenRack emphasizes quick and easy sharing of recorded content. Users can share content instantly through shareable links. In addition to the advantages, this tool also has disadvantages, such as limited features in free plan. The free plan may have limitations on recording time, storage, or access to advanced features. Another disadvantage is dependency on internet connection. Cloud-based features might require a stable internet connection. Users in areas with poor connectivity may experience limitations. Another disadvantage is Availability of advanced editing tools. While ScreenRack includes annotation tools, it might not have an extensive editing capabilities as some dedicated video editing software. If you use the Windows platform and don't want to install any additional tools on your device, you can use the built-in tool for capturing the screen, and that is Snipping Tool. It's a built-in screenshot utility in Windows that allows you to capture a portion of the entirety of your screen. To use the tool, you should open it on your device. Press the Windows key on your keyboard or click on the Windows icon in the taskbar. Then type Snipping Tool into the search bar and launch the software. The Snipping Tool window will be opened. In order to make a screenshot, navigate to the desired window that you would like to capture and click on the New button. Then choose the type of snip you want to capture, such as freeform snip, rectangular snip, window snip, or full screen snip. After selecting the type of snip, select the desired area of the screen that you want to capture, let's say the following link. Once selection is finished, the Snip in Tool windows will display the screenshot. On the Snip in Tool screenshot window, you can edit your screenshot using basic editing tools like a pen, highlighter, or eraser to mark up the screenshot. For example, click on the highlighter and highlight the desired area of the web page, let's say navigation menu, and it will be highlighted with its corresponding color. Then click on the File Save As option on the top left corner of the screen. The Save As window will be displayed. On that window, you can name the screenshot, select the type format such as PNG, GIF, JPEG, single file HTML, and save it on your device. We have only covered a few features of the Snipping Tool. You can familiarize yourself with more Snipping Tool features on the screen. There are not many of them, but even built-in tools like this has its own interesting functions like email integration, etc. That's all from our side. If there are topics that you would like to see, write a comment or question to the lecture. We hope to see you in the next video.